Hi, I'm Valerie from American Honda. In this video, I'll show you how to calibrate an indirect tire pressure monitoring system, or TPMS, using these steering wheel buttons and the driver information interface. It's a simple process that's really easy to do. An indirect TPMS doesn't use tire pressure sensors mounted in the wheels. Instead, it mainly uses the vehicle's wheel speed sensors to monitor and compare tire characteristics while driving. If it determines that one or more tires are significantly underinflated, it turns on the low tire pressure TPMS indicator to let you know. Because it learns the characteristics of each tire, the TPMS must be calibrated or it won't work like it should. Calibration just means the TPMS learns the tire characteristics while driving. Calibration must be done anytime you adjust the pressures in one or more tires, rotate the tires, or replace one or more tires. If you don't do it when needed, the low tire pressure TPMS indicator comes on and stays on after driving. Now, before beginning this calibration, there are a few conditions that must be met. The vehicle must be completely stopped with the transmission in neutral, if it has manual transmission, or park if it has CVT. All four tires must be the same type and size and set to the recommended cold inflation pressure listed on the driver's door jam label. And finally, the ignition must be turned to on. Okay, let's get started. First, I press the information button, then select vehicle settings using the arrow buttons and press the enter button. This takes me to the group screen where I see TPMS calibration. Next, I press the enter button again, which takes me to the setup screen where I can select either cancel or calibrate. I select calibrate using the arrow buttons then press the enter button one more time. I then see a calibration started message. And that's all there is to it. The TPMS automatically finishes calibration after about 30 minutes of accumulated driving going 30 to 65 miles per hour. I've shown you the basic steps in this video, but if you'd like to learn more about this, just refer to the owner's manual. I'm Valerie. And thanks for watching.